Ask your neighbor, why do you worry? You worry, 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 you sleep and you log out of this world. You now discover that your worry is a product of consciousness. If you are owing and they send you to a prison, somebody came out of prison and became a king. Go there and learn what God wants you to learn. They come out and be a king. What would you have to tell your children you overcame? That's why nannies are the one training your children because they have more sense than you. They've got to, you know, me. I'm a, I'm, I'm a, you know, I'm a working class, working class fool. Take the job away, you discover that that person is empty. The fact that you are a banker doesn't mean you cannot learn tailoring. There's a banker lady we used to know in Yanya those days. She will close from bank and go and fry a car with her, um, this thing, her mom. I think in Ado, her side. In Yanya, I have forgotten. People we are trooping to buy that akara because of the respect that woman brought. They say, what kind of woman is this? A banker, beautiful lady, frying akara with smile. Any accomplishment can stop you from growing. This world is too big for that small thing you call success. That thing you are calling I'm a billionaire. Many billionaires have walked through this world and they've died forgotten. It's not the presence of money that makes men leave their name in the annals of time. You want to be, a, you want to be remembered, raise a nation. Don't just raise a nation, raise a lasting nation. Because many nations have risen and fallen. Their memory wiped out from existence. How are you living today that is different from the way pagans live? You pursue needs, they pursue need. Like um, our brother, Apostle Austin was saying. Let your God do the one that they can do and go beyond them to do what they cannot do. Your God can give you money. Their God and their skill and whatever can give them money. Then your God takes his father. It's okay, you now lose the money. There they cannot. Because immediately, how are we going to survive? That's why they think church, you know, everybody in church is karma. In their mind, they think we are here collecting your money. Who have I called and say, you know, you've not paid your fight for the ministry. Does that break through your heart? Why have we not seen your fight? Who here can say I've called them to say that kind of thing? Even if you give us 10 billion, we will not come and clap for you. God who knows the heart of all men should reward you. And don't think because we give God 10 billion to the heaven, all of a sudden we say, let's come and bless him quick before we lose him. You may try for five years. Yes. The gift for your sacrifice may be a new wilderness. But you, if you overcome it, guess what? You will conquer the city. A man that can tame wild animals. The Bible says Jesus was with the wild animals. What is human means? It was after I started giving, I now lost my job. I will stand up and clap for you. Now, God was showing you that you, you were not growing since. Now it's time to grow. If you insult yourself first, nobody's insult will pay you. Whose rejection will pain you where you have denied yourself already? I'm teaching you the code of life by which I live that I've learned from the Lord. Whether in the parlor, whether in a stadium, whether in an event center, even if I have hundreds of people or two persons, my worship is intact. That's what our man of God was telling us. Your faith is what? Intact. What higher beings call growth, sir? A lot of times, lower beings cannot perceive it. I still find joy in chaos. I've got peace that makes no sense. And I won't be going under. I'm not held by my old strength. 
I put my faith in Jesus. He's never let me down. He's faithful through every season. So why would he fail now? He will. So why would he fail now? He won't. So why would he fail now? He won't. Sit down. We will soon stay the anointing. Sometimes when I'm overwhelmed, attack here. This one is saying this. This one is saying this. I remember all that I've gone through. The things God brought me from. And then the song will come out. I still find joy in chaos. I have got peace that makes no sense. And I won't be going under. They will start as you attack us and let that turn to admire us. Keep standing. Our greeting in this church, when you see me do your hand like this, is be strong. I don't know what you are going through, but be strong. Let time keep unfolding its possibilities. One will come that you will master. Let it keep unfolding its possibilities. Faithful to every season, not just one. So why would he fail now? Ah! If that thing could overcome you, man, it would have killed you by now. Do you think life is too merciful to allow you to breathe again? It would have killed you. Do you think people go to war and they don't know that warfare is for death or life? Do you think an enemy is fighting you just to test your strength? He's fighting to kill. Do you know how many times your heart stopped beating while you were sleeping that you don't know? I've taught my men and those of you close to me you've always heard me say it don't explain what don't explain it you fail if you learn something it stops being failure it becomes a lesson sir it may be unconventional but it's a lesson and now oh look at you just a common prostitute, sleeping with married men. Don't go and get a real job. Go, and then you allow the world to condition you. I discovered that knowledge can actually heal a man. The you that slept with five years ago when you were an unbeliever, it's not the you standing here. Knowledge can heal this body. I don't know how to. I've slept with her. Forget this thing she's doing. Holy, holy, you didn't sleep with me, sir. You cannot compare the gallant jewel standing here versus the jewel of 20 years ago. Levels don't change. A warrior is the one standing before you. <laughs> it will all tie you up. You are not Tommy. Oh, he's dull. I've told you many times in this church, there's no one who is dull. If I don't know mathematics, I know famimatics. You will do your mathematics, but when you are hungry, you will come to mathematics. Yes, Sit down. You have something to teach the professor. But that's what this word does. It makes you despise your own and hallow another person's own. So you become a slave to what? Oh my God. I'm a castle. The beauty of society is that not everyone is a professor. So why would he fail now? He would. We all exist in kingdoms, realms. And in those kingdoms and realms, we have thrones. In the, words of, in the world of mechanics, the mechanic is a king. In the world of banking, the banker, the banker is a king. Palacelomo. So guess what? You want to establish dominance in what you have, gain mastery. 
Your slingshot can kill Goliaths that spear could not bring down if you gain mastery. That thing telling you to be comfortable with your current level of delivery is what wants to limit you, sir. Yeshua never despised. In fact, if you study carefully, you will discover that he did his ministry more in the villages. Because in those days, uh, the kingdom of Israel was actually governed by the great Roman Empire. And guess what? Because of that, there was heavy Roman and Greek influence in Israel. And if you know Romans, they are people of high taste. There was no middle class in those days. You either have or don't have. You are either one who is highly esteemed or you are a peasant. And because those people would not appreciate his gospel, guess what? He went to the commoner. He started with the commoners. What do you want to go and tell a Roman about salvation from your sin? This centurion came after the centurion heard of the miracles that he was doing. He said, okay, I have a servant. He said, let me come there. He said, no. I'm a man under authority. If you have this authority, are we together? I have this one I'm holding now. If you have this authority, if you have this authority, you will not need to come to my house to heal my servant. Are we together? If you have this authority, you will not need to come to my house to heal my servant. You will simply what? Speak the word. Yeshua looked at him. Guess what? Faith is actually revealed by understanding. There are many principles at work in life. There are, there are principles that makes men king. There are principles that makes men slave. There is nothing for you in tomorrow. All you have is in your today. Listen carefully. Oh, my tomorrow is great. It's a very pious statement. But it should awaken you to maximize today. What I'm saying now, even if it's two people gathered here, I know that what I'm creating now, if media puts it on our platform, it will reach the whole world. So I will not wait for tomorrow. I will maximize now that I have. Today, God came to give us life. Someone say amen. Amen. Life. You are in Yanya Gwandara, but you know a king is here. A king. You, you, see, you don't need someone to tell you. You just know that you are beyond this place. So guess what? You are in Nyanya Guadara, but you are there looking for... See, if you begin to think beyond yourself, you will grow... Oh my God. You want to grow big, you want to become a nation, begin to think beyond yourself. Being in Nyanya there, and the thing you are thinking of is, how can I help these people around here? What can I... In those contemplations, revelations for movement will begin to come. You will now discover that this an Igbo smoker, there's a potential in him to become this... This person, there's a potential in them to become this. That is how captains raise the army. The mighty men of David you celebrate today, these were men who ran away from the city because they were owing. Some were fugitives. Some were criminals they were looking for. Where others saw a brick wall, David saw a mighty army. The same thing Jephthah did. The man to fear is the man that has nothing to lose. If your back is on the ground, the only place to go now is up. I'm not speaking motivation, I'm speaking life. Begin to live for once. Listen. I will share some secrets with you, then we'll close. Listen. Apostle Paul said, for the sake of the things that are ahead of him, the excellent things he was pressing into, he counted every other thing he had accomplished as what? Done. As waste. Let me teach you something that you should apply in your life. You want to have tomorrow, huh? Sacrifice today. You want to discover a new power that you have. Sacrifice the current power you have. 
You want to survive beyond your certificate. Keep your certificate one side and then be willing to start again. If you sacrifice your certificate, you will discover that there is a skill within you that only needs that sacrifice to unlock. Dependency. What is certificate? Man's approval that you have a knowledge. But the fact that you have approved that you have a knowledge, it doesn't mean that among those who have the knowledge, you will be the preferred. I always tell my men, if you keep religion outside, what else can you produce as a human being? Of what value are you? It's not easy to command people's attention. Don't think just anyone can be influential. Don't think just anyone's voice can be heard. Every time we utter our voices, it comes with the witness of our pain and our triumph. So even though I'm not a musician, if I sing and you feel weight, it's the weight of all I've gone through that has made me believe in God. That's what you're feeling. Papa Rome doesn't need to shout, yet you'll be feeling weight. A man that has obeyed God many years, if he said in Jesus' name, it is the weight of many sacrifices I speak in. Meanwhile, you can say, ah, 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 and you go back and pump is still calling you. <laughs> so why would he fail? <laughs> I heard a funny video. The woman called, he said, this pump Mr. Samuel, will you pay? He said, I will not pay. <laughs> The woman say, what is wrong with this man? <laughs> In those days, one of my friends terrorized one of these loan apti. They started begging him. They said, okay, don't pay all, just He fell now. He will. Hello, thank you for watching the video. And I hope you have a great access to you. And I hope it will go so long this time. If you haven't commented, if you haven't liked it, please do that. And for more videos, kindly subscribe to our YouTube channel to get more videos. God bless you.